the line. It's number six, Mel Burney, who's outjumped and outstayed them. Can you remember the day? I mean, was it, was I it can. a blur? I can. The blur w would be mainly after jumping about four or five. It was a bit of a blur after that. My son Connor was with me and Ted Walsh. We were up in the press stand, the old stand there, and Ted had two in it, so I was kind of getting half a run in commentary from him as well. <laughs> he was telling me I'm I was sure. still... I'm sure, I'm <laughs> sure. He was still in the race, he told me anyway, even though he was watching his own. Well, he's a credit to you, he looks wonderful. How old is he now? He's 18. He's 18, look at him, absolutely. Well, he's been busy since, he's, you know, he's been doing dressage for a couple of years, and. My daughter rode him in the RDS last year. She finished seventh and she was second at the Limerick show in the race horse to riding class. So uh, we've been keeping him kind of ticking over. And busy. Mm. Well, I think he's practically part of the family, isn't he? Oh, he is, yeah. Here's the man himself, the star of the show, double seven. Um, how does he compare to your old stable star, number six, Valverde? Ah, they're different in lots of ways. He'd, he'd have a bit more pace, I'd say, than number six. A uh, little bit classier horse. Like number six wouldn't have never, ever been able to go to Galway and win a, a good competitive handicap hurdle. But, uh, and he wasn't a good ground horse either. So, in a way, it's not that easy to compare them. But they were both very easy horses to train. Once you had them fixed, you just looked after them, kept them fresh and healthy and mentally well. What do you feel his strengths are? Why do you believe that he can be your second Grand National winner? Well, his style of racing, he loves. The more horses that are around him, I think the more competitive he is. He's not a fella you have to ride on the wide outside or inside or out of trouble. He doesn't mind being in the thick of things. Uh, he travels well. You can hang on to him until you need to you know, progress through the race. And He's never got into a battle, really, that he didn't come out on top. Going to a race like the National, it's, it's a whole new ball game, really. And uh, we just hope that they cope with the fences, with all that spruce flying up in the air in front of them. You'd wonder if, if it you know, has a negative effect on them. But if you can get them happy in the first circuit and they get into a nice rhythm, uh, there's no reason why he can't progress to the race and run a, run a good race.